everyone, this is, I can use a distributive property. So remember the di distributive property basically means that you just need to multiply. So if I was feeding my dogs, I would need to give Joey some food and I'd also have to give Addie some food. So I can't forget about that second term over here. And if I was using the tiles, it's basically saying that I have two groups of whatever's inside here. So remember four means I have four of the little units, the little squares, and then the X would be the big one. And then if I have two groups of that, I'm just gonna draw that again. So I have four more little units, and then one more X. So if I was to add it up, I'd have two X tiles, so that's two X, plus I have eight units. And if I wanted to use a shortcut for distributive property, I would do two times four is eight, so that comes in here, and then two times X would be two X. It doesn't matter if you write it two X plus eight, or eight plus two X, just it's still the same thing. Okay, same idea with number two, but on this one, it's weird because it's a negative, but they don't have a number here. But remember, anytime there's a negative, there's invisible one right here. So basically it's saying I do negative one times 20X and then negative one times negative four. So negative one times 20X is negative 20X. Remember, because a negative times a positive is a negative. And then negative one times negative four is a positive. So that would be plus four. So my answer is negative 20x plus four.